hello guys welcome back to the channel today is friday the 6th of may 2022 and we are in the after hours so on your screen we are looking at the mullen automotive inc stock price and you guys can see that today the stock lost 8.40 percent closing the week at one dollar twenty cents and now if you guys look at the five day graph you see that uh, the whole week was really uh, mitigated for mullen automotive uh, with the stock ending the week lower than it started however uh, the feds had their big meeting and they came out two days ago with uh, a hike of uh, interest interest rate so it means that uh, liquidity is quite tight right now the market responded uh, accordingly and you guys can see that the s and s and p 500 is down almost one percentage point dow 30 down about uh, 0 0.30 percent nasdaq down 1.40 Russell 2000 down 1.69 and crude oil keeps going up. Right now it's trading at $110 a barrel, representing an increase of 2.17% compared to yesterday. So uh, the 52 week range for Mullen Automotive is about 52 cents all the way up to $15. Uh, today's volume is, uh, was a bit timid just at about 50 million shares that exchange hands compared to uh, an average volume of 140 million shares now uh, the big news that came out was that uh, there was some pr that came out today and it's that mullen is extending its uh, tour that it will be doing across the united states or uh, there will be a segment that will be in spring 2023 and they will have the Mullen 5 with them, of course. So uh, for this fall, starting in October, I believe, uh, they will be doing 19 uh, venues across the United States, 19 cities across the United States. And uh, that will last over a period of about six weeks. And then uh, now they just came out with an additional uh, segment of that tour, which will be in spring of 2023. So yeah they're taking the mullen 5 on the road and i think uh, that means uh, automotive writers in local markets up and down the country will be able to jump into the mullen 5 and actually test uh test drive the vehicle the numbers we're getting are just mind-boggling uh acceleration to the range it's just impressive and in most of those metrics it's uh way better than tesla so i know it's with a lot of anticipation that people are waiting to actually see the mullen 5 in person jump into it test drive it and then have their own uh, opinion you know that they uh, can draw from their own personal experience with the vehicle it's a very good move on the part of mullen and i think uh, it shows that they are very willing to have customers uh, and prospective customers have a hands-on experience with the vehicle uh, if we look at the monthly, we see that there has just been a slow, steady and painful decline. But uh, if you look at the price of crude oil at $110, with some estimates saying that we might see it hit all the way up to $140 by summertime 2022, I think there is a big, big space uh, that needs to be filled with electric vehicles. So let us know what you guys think uh do you think that uh, mullen should actually concentrate more on uh, getting its vehicles to market instead of doing the road show uh especially that there's so much uh, pent-up demand or do you think that you know they should take their sweet time and uh, do the road show and allow all the processes to go you know according to plan without any sense of urgency up to you guys let us know in the comment section anyways that's what i have to share with you guys uh, that mullen automotive unfortunately today went down a further 8.40 percent and uh, hopefully we start seeing some recovery here soon not just with electric vehicles but in the economy as a whole thanks for joining me don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and also subscribe to the channel 
I will catch you guys on the next one. Bye.